Hello friends, Iceberg out of Dylan Brothers Harley Davidson, and today I'm going to take you through a quick walkthrough of this 2020 Harley Davidson Sportster Iron 1200. I gotta tell you friends, this is definitely one of my favorite Sportsters out of the lineup. Really reminds me of the Nightster a lot, which I was an enormous fan of. Um, this is one of the bigger model Sportsters, so if you are a little bit taller, you can kind of stretch out on this bike a little bit more than say like on your 48 or your 883. This bike has been upgraded power-wise. We're gonna move back to that engine where you can see that Vance and Hines intake on there, and then that is perfectly tuned and matched with that all black Vance and Hines short shot exhaust. I absolutely love Vance and Hines. They go on all of my motorcycles and the short shots on these Sportsters sound incredible. They also look very nice and shave some nice weight off of it as well. So you're getting that upped power delivery and you reduced weight on this motorcycle and the sound is amazing. I am gonna take the opportunity right now to fire this bike up so you can hear that Vance and Hines exhaust. As I said, that exhaust sounds incredible on this motorcycle. Once again, huge fan of the Vance and Hines. Let's go ahead and move up and talk about a few of the other upgrades on here. As you can see, there has been a windshield added to this motorcycle. It is just a smaller windshield, not really going to give you a whole lot of like head buffering protection, but it is going to keep the wind from pounding on your chest when you're out doing those interstate rides. Uh, this is not necessarily a quick detach, but it does come off with a couple turns of some bolts on here. So if you wanted to strip that off for some in-town riding to feel that wind come across to you, easy enough. Uh, pulling back from that, you do have the stock 10-inch bobber bars on here. Uh, very comfortable. Once again, as I said, a little bit larger on the Sportster side, so those bars just kind of add to that ride and comfort. Uh, moving down, as you can see, this does have the mid controls on this. I personally love mid controls. It keeps your center of gravity exactly where it's meant to be on the motorcycle, and you can get very aggressive in the corners on that. Uh, this bike does have passenger pegs, but right as of now, it just has a solo Harley Davidson seat on it. You can get a two-up seat for this motorcycle and some hardware to put a quick detach if you were to take a passenger on here. But as I said, the passenger pegs are on it right as of now. Let's go ahead and move up to the gas tank on here where you have the three and a half gallon. I mean, it's just a hair shy of three and a half. It's 3.3 gallons if you want to be exact and technical. Uh, you're going to average around 48 miles to the gallon on this motorcycle. So you are going to get plenty of riding time on this bike before worrying about having to fuel up. As this motorcycle sits on our floor, survey says, it has a whopping 549 miles on it. That is correct, under a thousand miles on this motorcycle. It has gone fully through our service shop, so it needs absolutely nothing except a new rider to take it down the road. And if you are local in Omaha, Nebraska, would like to see this 2020 Iron 1200 in person, please stop out at Dillon Brothers Harley Davidson today. Come talk to any of our sales staff. They are all happy to help you out. And as always, from the entire Dillon Brothers Harley Davidson family, thank you so much for checking out our videos. And always remember, gear up, ride safe. Thanks a lot.